anything else, just let us know. Oh, you... Ah, thank you. Of course. I'm gonna put this in your drawer for later. Leave that potion on. It's yours. So, <coughs> help him into his seat, Zaki. Right. I can stand. Come on. I think you meant Soma. Oh, sorry. Oh, great. Come on, Soma. Come on. Oh. May I help? Lay your shoulder on oh. oh, there it is. Up under the bed. Come on. Right. You've done plenty of work. Thank you. Lay down if you need. More than enough. <laughs> You're right, scared the shit out. Oh, sleepy. Those things tracked back to Adwick. I knew I should have fucking bumped. Hey, big man. Are you acquainted with the Butcher, Baylor? I am. Is everything okay? It's, it's a little busy in there, so you may have to wait. I need to speak with him. <sighs> Haven't seen him around for a case. while. Um, last I saw, he was leaving the walls. That was a while ago, though. Then the smith, the Schwerter. Aunt's in there, he's being treated for wounds though. Goblin attack. The Schwerter was lay low by pests. I'm not sure what you mean. I forget. <laughs> Nothing. <sighs> May I ask you a qu few questions? Sure. The Shvartar, the one called Arn. Mm hmm A similar scent to him. Uh, I smell like him. <sighs> yes. What is he to you? He is my father. <sighs> Hello, Loggy. She's gonna be all right. Yeah, I saw. Didn't stop bleeding. Good. Thanks for helping. When you're finished talking, your dad needs support on his right side. Grumbled about not being able to feel his shoulder or something. He won't let me get close. In fact, I know put another purple person that he does let get close. If he is injured. Very. He's injured oh, and pushing himself. Yeah, and I don't stop him from doing that. He never listens to me. Reason. I have propped him up against a chair, so at least he's not just free waiting all that injury, but... That's good, at least. He refuses to leave Raylan's side. Well, she'll probably be staying I there tonight. I would press the wound. That's good. She'll be safe from the monster that acts in the shadows. The monster that wears no fucking armor makes my job a lot easier if I have to do anything about it. Shadows. 
is a very, very dangerous person walking around right now, Loggy. They dodged a crossbow bolt in the dark. Point blank range. Have you ever known someone that can do that? There we go. Oh. Yes. There we go. go back. Oh. Hello. Have a good night. Yeah. Bye, Haskell. Well. <laughs> we have your key. What pocket is it? <laughs> Match to answer heaven. your question. <laughs> yes. Once. What do they look like? The first time a I've long ever seen time it. ago. So. What do they look like, Sarah? Person. <laughs> we are convinced it's Oleander. Those pouches that they wear on their back as the same potions or whatever's hanging off of them, I remember. You See? shot a crossbow at him? In the dark? Oh, yes. Yes. When we were down, you know, in a place that was dark, and they were down there as well. Huh. And I shot at one. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I shot at one in Donmaya. I didn't make the connection. Donmaya, I shot him point blank in the daytime. A few feet away from his face, and he still dodged it. Fucking annoying. You're all right. Maybe just a, just a... You shouldn't be walking around like this at night, ma'am. It's dangerous people lurking about. Drow, right? <laughs> yes. What about it? Never seen one before. Get a good look, I guess. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not as. I haven't lived as long as I've been realizing. So... You that elf I scared the shit out of. Out on the bridge. <laughs> no, <laughs> it is. <laughs> Go off to your fucking home, it's getting dark. There are goblins about. Shoo. Shoo. Do you do, like, a little bit of books of, like, booze every so often? Oh, I fucking murdered her. She was leaving Adwick. Okay. She was leaving the castle. <laughs> and I'm sitting on the bridge. And me, I can see in the dark. I don't need a torch. So I'm chilling on the bridge and I see a compass. Mm -hmm. I'm speaking to my, um... <sighs> I'm speaking to Cade. And... Mm. I just decided I wanted to go boo. And she screamed so loud and then ran off into the forest. It was the funniest fucking thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Poor thing. Uh, it's she always said good everything's alright in there know, now. Do a little book and laugh. So. Mm -hmm. It's always a good change. By the way, I'm expecting a tip for whenever you need that portrait. A <laughs> tip? The tip you're gonna get is the tip of my sword in your mouth. Boy. <sighs> oh, shut up. Don't growl at me. He knows I'm joking. Why can't you figure it out? Look at that face. Do you see that face? My goodness. Look how much anger is in those eyes. Ulagi. Who shit in your cereal this morning? What is it's no cereal? Fun. It's a breakfast. You made of grain, you pour milk over it. I don't understand this land. <laughs> Neither do I. But I have my fun with it when I can. How are you feeling? Tired, I guess. Frustrated. 
with a few different things. <laughs> mm. You upset? You better help. Say again. Were you upset you weren't there to help them? No. I, mean, I can't really do much anyway, I just have this shitty fucking whittling dagger, so... And you do have two silver now. Yep. And your father is a very blacksmith. I see that changing very soon. You having just a whittling knife. Yeah, apparently we don't Maybe have enough money or... about that tomorrow. Uh, I already have. <laughs> apparently we don't have enough money for, uh, or materials to repair my old sword. <sighs> well, but he dropped four silver on I a gamson. I have good news. Mm-hmm. Oh. And has his sword. Thanks, Dad. Um... Yeah. I have, I have good news. I spoke to Nisk about your hood. She says it's going to be two silver and sixty copper. For a hood? Yes, for a hood and mask. I need more than that. I know. It's difficult. I have a few plans as to how to get more coin, and I will be splitting it with you, as both of us are at the shit end of the stick. Yeah. I have a crossbow, no bolts, and two useless fucking daggers. <laughs> I can't do the things I need to do if people know it's me. Two silver, fifty copper, sixty copper. We'll get it by tomorrow, okay? If I have to take a silver out of mine and you take a silver out of us, we'll do it. <laughs> For a hood, that doesn't disguise who I am. I need a full new set of clothes. A hood and a mask. And a mask, and I'm still purple. And if you wear a hood and a mask, no one should know who you are. Or they're meant to game you. Not Being quite. A fucking bitch. You, will find, you will find in towns such as this overpopulation. And the constant fear of what could be. There's it actually a lot drier around than you think. Features. Say again, Hulagi. There are far fewer people than you would think who pay close attention to the features of others in a town as filled with people as this one. Mm -hmm. But if I need to interact with someone, they would know. Because there's only two purple people here. And I don't have there's tips. Not. There's yeah, not uh, only two people I here. I've said that three times now. There's more draw. I wonder when he'll listen. There's more everything. He fears for his father. It is understandable. This is a huge I city. Would ask you a if I may. Uh, I wasn't much paying attention, but if I could get my uh, house key back. Oh. <laughs> I forgot. <sighs> what the fuck is going on? Thank you for that, though. Boy. <sighs> I forget your name, Jenny. I would speak with you privately. Should we take a walk? In place of your father. Oh, fuck off. Don't mind me. I'll just go... BE ALONE SOMEWHERE ELSE! You this sweet. will not take long. It's not allowed in one conversation. It gets grumpy. What's up?
Did you come to Adwick with your father, or did you meet him here? I came with him. I see. Then I will be brief. You, your father, and those close to you. I am aware of your circumstances. They are none of my business. I will not delve into it. It is not my place. I will say only this. There are those who have come to me with fears about what lies in the woods. The trees that move with no wind. There are those who seek to cut them down. Do we know who? It's gonna lean in very close and whisper. Those with skin of blue glow in the night. Really? They came to me believing that I would see their side. But it is not my business to be involved in. I have seen what this forest is capable of for myself. And even now, I owe it my life. Perhaps what I have been told is true. Perhaps you and yours are... unsavory. But that does not matter to me. I made a promise to a child of the North. I do not break my promises. I am not so foolish as to believe the whimsical wolves in whims of ones who do not even understand what it is to walk on soil. And so, if you require my strength, the Shwertar may know that he may call upon me. But I suggest you act. I, I will let him know in private. Thank you, Hulagi. Do not thank me. Until the deed is done. That is all I needed. Go. Okay. You have a good night. They're involved, we would have to. Carter, are you all right? I'm fine. Uh, 
need to talk to you in private when I can. Is it about who I think it is? I don't know who you're thinking it is. Know. It's a lot of things. Last oh. time we saw him, he had the stupidest fucking eye. No, not him. Something else. But I'm glad you know. I'll step outside with you. I'll be right back. If you must, you can use my house. That might be safer. If you need the privacy. Ulagi came to me earlier. Ulagi. Mm. <clears throat> as cryptic as he was, he said, um, Well, there are people who want to cut down the trees that walk without wind. I asked him who. Fuck. He said, The people with blue skin. Apparently they approached him thinking he would be sympathetic to their cause, but to him, he believes that the forest has given him enough. Who approached him? The people with blue skin, I'm assuming the Tritons. Which ones? I'm not sure. You don't think? I don't know. That's why I brought you here instead. She seems to be the most boisterous out of all of them. I also know that Mirandor's been talking to the Tritons a lot, too. I don't know if he's... Yeah. Cut them down. They're looking to kill me and Dale. From what I gathered, yes. Then we gather our friends and we kill them first. This is just what Ulagi says. I don't know. Can you trust him? Can we trust him to lie? Ah. Okay. <clears throat> I'll find out what she knows without raising suspicion. I don't know anything about the other two. In fact, I spoke to Kidas for the first time today. I found out from Lucy, and he's been asking a lot of questions about me. If they're working close with Mirandel, well, you already know what I'll say. Yeah. Matter of time. <sighs> Have I said I'm tired? Did I mention that? It's that heart tired we talked about the other day, isn't it? Just to your very core. It's my very core. I feel it. There's a fucking inquisitor here, my god. Yeah. Polyander, no less, by the description. He looked at me, he recognized me. When I was told he came off Baylor and some of the others. Recognized them probably as well. But he didn't imply. He has to be here for another reason. 
Maybe he's just scouting the capital to see if it's ready to be attacked. Inquisitors never scouts, not that I know of. The only time I've been near an Inquisitor is they're hunting someone. There are two people here they'd be hunting for. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, some days I think it might have been easier to just be brave burned already. <sighs> then you wouldn't have met me. I know, and your life would be so much better. <laughs> Glad I did meet you. And are you? Did um Husk go uh, talk to you? Be heavy of all this nonsense going on. But you do make it better, my boy. I hope so. You. The old skull talked to me about what? I mentioned something to him last night and he said he'd talk to you, maybe, about it. I'm not sure. More than likely he did, I just don't remember. I raised concerns about... You'll forgive me this... Poison still has been a woozy. Sure, we can talk about it another time, it's okay. Right. Anyway, I'll be more guarded then. We should, yeah. I know what she needs. <clears throat> Come on, let's I get you back inside. Friend that wishes to speak to you outside of the walls. That very same treatment. Let's just say it helped you now. From the very same one that helped you. Would you like me to take you? Earlier today, rather. Hmm. Yes. Uh, I, I can also tell him he must wait till tomorrow. If you're too tired, it will be a walk. It's outside <clears> the gates. First thing I would bring I him in here. I'd yeah. bring him in here, but that would cause a lot of trouble. Hmm. I'll let him know you are not well to speak today. I will go out by the swamp bridge first thing in the morning tomorrow. Understood. I'll yeah. be leaving for the night then. Rest well, Raylan, on. Kyla. Thank you. I'll accompany Lucian. you. Right. Keep doing your thing. Really? <laughs> Thank you. Remember what I said, Raylan. Hmm. Fucking busy day. <sighs> Can we sleep together tonight? Or are you gonna blow me off as well? Oh, you first tried with Cade, and now your backups. God, you are not a backup. That's not how my brain works, silly boy. I was looking for you. Well, I have to go tell someone something. You can walk with us if you want. After that, I'll be probably heading to sleep. Very well. Right. Delivered the message. Oh, 
Excuse me. Busy day, Ulagi. Busy day. And yet I feel like I accomplish nothing. You survived. That is not nothing. I suppose. I'm getting pretty good at that. It's all I did for a while. I'll uh, let you two talk. She doesn't speak much English, common, sorry. You speak Elven? I don't know. Just little friend. Eat. Eat. Careful. Like said, I heard something. There's a growling I on top of the goblins. Well. Goblin. I heard it as well, yet everyone in the streets claimed they heard nothing. I could hear it from the tavern. <laughs> that is not why I wish to speak to you. I will look at it in a moment. Hmm. Well. I thank you for it. You might want to get back to your getting late. Good night! Cute little bastard. Alright, does this need to be a private conversation? It concerns what we discussed yesterday. I'll take my leave. Mm. Nice talking to you, leather worker. Hi. Also, one more thing. You don't have a pail that, well, one that do it piece by piece. I have nothing to that. It's not how I work. I get it all in one go. Very well. Have a safe Just night. Me. You as well. I trust him. I don't know about you, but I'd be alright with him staying for this. I mentioned that yesterday, in the night, I accompanied an acquaintance of mine, a young woman, to her home in the so-called poor quarter of town. Mm. I could not see in the dark past the light of a torch, but I have been a hunter for a long time. Sight is not the only sense one has. I remember you I telling me that someone was harassing you. It was more than that. They spoke from the shadows. Said Bjorning. Steve, the hunter, is now the hunted. Yes, I remember that. What is that, if not a threat? And it is not one you ever I think it could maybe from. be a joke? Or a prank, or something? We have a lot of trickster people in this town. Few I can name off the top of my head. This friend I told you of. Because we were being followed and I had them bar their door when they entered the house. Placed whatever they could against the door to ensure none could enter. As I stepped away, I heard someone jostling at the door, trying to open it. When I turned back, they were gone. This person meant harm. 
At least I am certain. I simply do not know who it was. Who are you escorting? I would ask they you to show not. me what house it is. I liked his question, that's why I was pointing at him. <laughs> ah, I did not hear it. Oh, um, who are you escorting? Who's your friend? A young woman with a troubled past named Iris. Oh. I've been hearing that name a lot today, actually. Ulagi, I, I recommend sir. you just leave that alone. I would if I had not been personally challenged. But you don't even know what you're messing with, Ulagi. That's not very smart. I do not. I have not have survived. No on you. I have not survived as long as I have by allowing those who would taunt to simply walk away because they one time that it is not a upset joke about being taunted verbally very pathetic you are a strong man standing taller than a fucking building and you get disgruntled by someone whispering at you in the dark honestly and what was it you said that someone like myself could easily be attacked in the dark when I cannot see and I would be laid low. That my strength would not matter. I am not taking a chance. I would know who this person is. And then I would determine if they were serious or not. All right. All right. If you need any help, I can help you at night. But not during the day. I am useless. This is why I come to you now. You can do what I cannot. Even now? This does not have to be today. I can post up if this you is want. Why I'll have more energy you. tomorrow. Oh, if we go together, That'll we can do. get it done very quick. Well, we could at least post up. I go back to the I need, by myself. I need oh, only know... Who the, I know a place. I need only know who this person is and what their intents are, and if they are in any way unsavory. Then I, I will okay. remove them. Well, Ulagi, if they're uh, trying to break into someone's house at night time, they're probably not very savory people, and if they're threatening you. So we'll just figure out who it is, and then you can... That is the idea. Okay. To the poor quarter then? There's lots of roofs to be jumping upon. Mm. Show us the house. Or should we do it tomorrow? I will show you the house now. And then it is your decision how and when to do it. I'll discuss it further instead of just jumping right in. I don't feel like that's a good idea. You're better at this, Kyla. Probably just going to be asking you. Well, we're just watching, really. We're not really doing anything major. Yes, and you're better at that than I am, because I can't sit still for more than five fucking minutes. <laughs> oh, you mean the man who was attacked by goblins? Well, yes. It's the that the woods are quiet nearby. <sighs> Very well. Good evening. Oi, purple man. The fuck? <laughs> he has Have a you... fucking name. I wasn't Hi. talking to you. I don't fucking you care. Seen... Flips oh. you around, light push. <laughs> gets you walking oh. the other direction. Gets you walking in the other direction. Hey, I have a I question like for him. <laughs> ah, let's go. You have three seconds. Three, two. Three, man, one, blue two, shirt, mustache, sleeping. Sleeping. Fucking <laughs> On my end, we said that at the exact same time, same exact way, <laughs> same exact syllable. Sting. Birds over feather. <clears throat> Holy fuck. 
Ich bin Lord wie ich. Es kann ein fucking Tomahawk. Ich bin sicher, das ist eine gute Idee. Ich bin der fucking Size of him. Ja, und dann was? Got it. This one. Mm. Easy enough. I saw her earlier today in the village. She already been attacked. Mm. I do not know where she is now, but I know she was alive at the time. Okay. Well, we'll keep an eye on the house. Even if she's not there, if someone goes in, we can keep an eye on them. I will actually post up tonight. Spend the night watching the house. Yeah. So I can write it in the book. I can get it rolled off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll accompany you. What about you? Cool. Well, Nagi, I do not recommend you stay here any longer. It's getting dark. Heads up, the house is not locked. Just the note. Have you even checked if she's in there? I was out for much of the day. Let me Heard of goblins. Am I seeing the girl? I'm gonna like peek in. I don't like it here. Fuck. She's gonna throw the door open and show you. <laughs> get him out. Get him out. Get him out. Okay, quick repeat. The floorboards have been torn up. Looks like there was something underneath. The uh, table has been f practically toppled over. Chairs too. Look, uh, things are bundled up, and it looks like people left in the rush. Is there any blood? Anyone see any blood on the ground? No blood. He's gonna check by the Just broken floorboards. He's gonna break a piece off, and he's gonna smell it. The fuck? He's memorizing the scent. Here came in here looking for stuff, and I think uh, a few brass skulls came inside too. Footprints, if anything. I'm gonna roll. No, he's not gonna. Oh. He's not gonna connect with it. Was she here or not? Is this a setup? What is this? No, this was intentional. This is not there, a setup. There is was a crumpled paper. There is a crumpled paper in this bin over here. I will roll for seeing it since it's dark. I got a 10. Damn. 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 Uh, with a 10, you can see in the dark, so you're gonna, you're gonna have your time than other people. You are a drow. Uh, and given that it's not uh, a closed object, you will come across it. You're a drow. Aha. Uh -huh. You're a drow? <laughs> Crumple piece of paper. Can you read? Not the common tongue. Okay. Good thing I slightly can. <laughs> oh, open you read better than me. <sighs> it says. Oh god, hold on, sorry, I just almost froze. Uh, it said, "To my lovely <laughs> child, I fear that I might die today." Then you see it be that scribbled out because she's trying to hide it. I don't know what's gonna happen. Uh, Ulagi said something about. Um, prepared. Baylor said fear or to keep quiet. Cade talked to me. I don't. And then it just cuts off. And then it, that, that it's all crumpled. Fuck. He realizes it as Fuck. best he can. Fuck. Where, Where do they sleep? Alright. This was the house. This was the only place. No, 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 not them, the brass skulls. Where do they sleep? They're all over the place. I do not They're know. a gang. I think I know where ours might be, if she is still around. 
Let's go check them. Make sure. Okay. I'll follow behind. Come on. It's out of the city, though. She spent the day being treated in one of the farmhouses. I think people were trying to convince her to leave. It's probably for the best if she has a babe. Well, if she's constantly being attacked and harassed, then yes. So... Hopefully she's Hello. fucking gone. Mm-hmm. Hopefully she's fucking gone. Just follow his high nights of white hair and you'll be fine. Is it dark dark? I do not. Not yet. Okay. I was gonna say. Yeah, I know. The reason why our hair is white is He's gonna it's go in and knock. Wait, so he's gonna knock. Knock, knock, knock. Do I get a response? Due to the lack of sun, we have lost the pigment in our hair. No response. I she figured. I'm right here. Sorry, I'm right here. I, sorry, I just came out. Um, you saw a oh. lot of blood. Was the door unlocked? Kind of all in that area. Uh, the door is unlocked. Okay. Then I just pushed it open. <laughs> Okay. Okay. What do we see? So you see blood. You see blood all around the uh, the bed where she was lay uh, laying. The bed is no longer there. It looks like they took it with it. Um, there's uh, a few uh, dragon nettle pieces around. Uh, there's a what looks like drips from a red like potion, kind of on the floor. Um, I think there's an empty bottle somewhere. I think that's purple poison. I don't know. That part I don't know about. That's really fucked up in here. And so they... Then, uh, there, there's a trail of blood, like drips, leaving, leading to the door. So they left. If they've taken the bed, then they've successfully left, right? I fucking hope so. Let's follow Let's this blood. This leads. leads towards the farm, but stops, uh, halfway. Like, like the, the barn where, like, the bull is and stuff. Oh. Yeah, not, As a not trigger, he's... Oh. Wait, which way? Which way am I going? Oh, you know what, hold on. I'm just gonna, oh. hold on. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna turn into an owl really quick, so it makes it easier. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. You? Jesus Christ. Oh, it turned into a bullet. <laughs> I've lost a tracker, he's checking the ground. Is a trained hunter. I'm gonna give myself a roll. You're also gonna see uh, wagon tracks right That's here. That's a net twenty. If you look over. Ooh. I got a net twenty. Okay, oh. so because you're an amazing tracker and shit, uh, you see the uh, wagon tracks from here, and then there's a little blood pile or puddle just, just at the base of it, where there's also randomly mixed with horse shit. That was the cue. Is Ooh. the wagon gone? 
The wagon is indeed gone. So they left. So and so's wagon. That's where he puts Travis's it. Wagon. That's where he that's where Travis keeps his wagon. Looks like they left. Ulag is tracking them. He's scared that they're uh, Who? Fuck. Yes. Yes. Goblins. I don't know. We're on the trail. I'll let you know. Is that? I don't know. <clears throat> a friend, though. What do you mean you don't know? What, what, what did he say? That's the guy who's coughing on everyone. You are right. Yeah, fine. He said that they're not on this side of the forest. So... I don't know. What did you get from over there? Can we track them? The wagon's gone. Travis's wagon. Go ahead. There's blood trailed all over the place, the wagon's missing, there's wagon tracks in the dirt, and there's horse shit on the ground. So, they left then? Yeah, there's no trace of anyone over there. Maybe we Which should, uh... The brass skulls don't know where the fuck they are. But... That's all we need to worry about. Unless they wandered into goblins. Fucking goblins. Always fucking goblins. Where do we even begin to start fucking looking for that? Probably across the road. We want to follow where they were, right? And we need Ulagi for it. Mm. Where is he? There he is. Why am I Where are they? Oh. The girl and the wagon, where did they go? I don't know. Lucky. Lucky. We don't know who this man is. Could be a monster. I'm worried that they got in the wagon and left, and then got hit by those goblins that came in. We should follow the road to make sure they're okay. They should be fine. How would you know that if you do not know where they are? Movement behind us. Torches. Looks like the leather worker. It's just Zachary and the leather worker. They also have a carriage. Goblins. 
He's convinced I say, as the goblin smell is gone. I do not trust someone who obscures their face. But so be it. If they are gone, oh, sh sh my yeah. carriage. The luggy you should go with him, Kyla. I'm gonna head back to go to sleep. Yeah, I've get some enough. rest. See you, uh, for that. Well, do we even need to do that anymore now? No. What's that? My face. <sighs> Certainly, this does not preclude what I asked you earlier. I would still like you to find out who it was. All right, I will be posting up in the poor district, then on the roofs. I will you can find me when you go to sleep, or don't. Yeah, I'll probably post up with you. Good night. Good night. Good. I'll uh, keep my chains visible. Good, good, good night, random stranger. Good night, you loggy. Be safe. Perennium. Lead the way. But know this, if I even think that you are toying with me, I will cut you down. I would do the same. Birds of the flapper. If you do not wish, I'd like to at least know what happens between you two. Have you seen? Have you seen? Um, oh, sorry. sorry about that. Um, have, you, have you seen Baylor around? I, I need to get my shield back. No, I haven't seen him. You fuck. You uh, checked his butchery. Well, that's a good thing I have the sword. Uh, um, I guess we'll have to check back there then. Mm -hmm.
How do you know where I was? How do you know of that which I spoke? Uh, I watch and listen dutifully. It is important to listen. Kyla knows. That's why he fucking ran up to him and was like, they've gone, because he knew that they were fucking looking for them. There are those who had designs on them. When he was talking to fucking Baylor <clears throat> earlier, he was like, I heard this information already, and Baylor said, no, this is new. If he doesn't know from that, then he's fucking suspicious. <laughs> This is lining up with exactly what Baylor was talking about, so. I was the I have proof. Names I Red headed skull. Try to warn her. They were coming. She locked her door, barricaded away. Put it. Save her. Who are you? Yeah, I was gonna, he was gonna like fucking Navy Seal his way in. <clears throat> if you wish to strike me down, do it. I will not hurt you in return. Thank you. 
feel the hand on your left shoulder, and it spins you around. You attempt to do that, and you hit wood. And he backs away. you have told me the truth and that you are not the one who was there that night the one who spoke from the shadows for if you are and I find out you will die A beast who believes himself a nut. I swore an oath to him. And by my word, I will remove Any who would bring harm to him and those that he calls friends by my blood I made that oath Sounds if there is one He's a good man, and my oath for him is absolute, and if there are any who would bring harm to him or those he holds close, I will remove them, if I even catch an inkling of it. That is my responsibility, and I will see it through. If you mean them no harm, but you cannot tell me who does, beyond this skull, then our business is concluded.
eyes are not the only thing which carries me through this life. But I will take your warning into consideration. Watch well, but do not cross me. He walks away. He walks away. Well, I, I, I walk away. So you can see in the dark too, huh? No, I... Wow. I jest. I cannot see clearly in the dark, no. But I have been a hunter for more than three of your lifetimes. Hmm. There are more senses in the body than just sight. And I have learned to hone all of them. You can smell. I can smell. I can hear. I can taste on the air. Even touch. Feel the difference. Between two sets of bark, two mounds of dirt. It is how I track. It is how I hunt. You must be the greatest hunter in Araland. does not mean much, considering the types of creatures that wander your woods. What's the biggest thing you've killed? Skittish. It was when I was younger. There are these, shall we say, wolves in the north. They are known as dire wolves to those who do not come from Hayloth. Some stand as tall as the buildings of the village. No. Come on, Alagi. That sounds really cool, though. I do not know what you mean by that word, but if you say so. Uh, impressive. I mean, it's re yeah, it seems really impressive, and I would like to see one one day, maybe. For your sake, I pray you never have to. Uh. You would have to go to the north, and if I tell you this, the north is filled with creatures far more dangerous, far more massive. Than even a dire wolf. And it's snowy. I hate the snow. Maybe I'll stay here. I prefer it. Ireland is too warm. Hmm. You know, I only saw snow for the first time ever last winter. Say again, my uh, eyes stopped working. I said, I remember it. I was in this land at the time. It was very light. It's the only way to cure my composing depression. 
Go. Go. Go home. Hold on. Wait a minute. Never cut you on. What? He didn't give it. You just smacked his. You smacked him this way, it's and his head went the it's other way. Not the same to you. Mm, good to know. What? Why the hell might went one way? My head went <coughs> the other. Lagi. It's a special technique for Captain Dario. Okay. I'm going to go um Being a take care of that thing. Captain I'll Kate see you tomorrow. Shilbrook. You are I a power of that you do of not understand. I've killed no one in my life. <laughs> Besides just a couple of people. And kinda. <laughs> Most of them mm -hmm. are grannies. That's not uh -huh. me. Captain, I remember when you do not one forget what I told you. Well. Yes. Yes. I never did that. I do not know your circumstances oh, beyond no, what no, I have no, told. No. And I will not pretend to involve myself in matters that are not my own. But I over my life. And I believe this is a small repayment. Of course. I've told the people they need to know. We're uh, working on it. Thank you for letting us down. Mr. Shilbrook. Wait a minute. No, no, no. I won't judge. When you draw. Don't know what that means. Sir, permission to arrest that man. No, I don't arrest Means him. goodbye. Oh, uh, oh Ren, Ren Yun, no. Alright, one more good oh. we'll walk then. Have fun. Karen Yun. Karen Yun. Most yearnings would <sighs> give me what is the term in the common tongue? Shit. For telling you. <laughs> It'll be our little secret. Another Bjorning can go fuck themselves. Whoa. Are there ladders to get onto this one? For those of that didn't catch that, up, up, and then down this way, and then I post up here, <sighs> like Robin. <laughs> Love you too, Trap Man. Good shit today. And that's where Kyla posts up for the rest of the night. <clears throat>